Hello viewers, I am Fareen Hina and welcome to my new video. In this video, I am going to share about parts of speech and the topic will be verbs. What is a verb? A verb is one of the most important parts of the sentence. It tells the subjects, actions, events or state of being. For example, I accidentally locked the door. Over here, locked is an action. The glass damaged with a loud noise. Over here, damaged is an event. Nowadays, she feels angry all the time. Feels is state. Kinds of verbs. Action verbs, linking verbs, helping verbs. Action verbs. A verb that shows action is called an action verb. The action verb tells what its subject does. Exercise for action verbs. Melanie climbed the stairs two steps at the time. Over here the action verb is climbed. The children ate all their food. Ate is action verb. Next, the workers installed a new window in the living room. Installed is action verb. Linking verbs. A linking verb links its subject to a word in the predicate. Linking verbs express a condition or a state of being. Exercise for linking verbs. Number one, the lesson seemed easy. Seemed is a linking verb. The meal is now cold, now too cold. Is is a linking verb. This dress looks amazing on you. Looks is linking verb. Helping verbs. A helping verb helps a main verb express action. The combination of one or more helping verbs is called a verb phrase. Not every sentence will have a helping verb with the main verb. When you see an ing verb such as running, be on the lookout for a helping verb also. Sometimes there is another word which separates the helping verb from the main verb. One common example is not. A sentence may contain up to three helping verbs to the main verb. Exercise for helping verbs. Could you help him with that? Here could is a helping verb. Where will you move to? Will is a helping verb. It might rain tomorrow. Might is a helping verb. Transitive verbs. A transitive verb does have a direct object. Intransitive verbs. Intransitive verbs are action verbs that do not have a direct object. Linking verbs are always intransitive. Intransitive verbs never answer the questions who or what. Present tense verbs. An action verb that describes an action is happening now is called present tense verb. For example, the bird flies through the sky. Here flies is a present tense verb because it is happening right now. Past tense verbs. Verbs which tells about actions which happened some time ago are past verbs. Example, the dog wanted a bone. Here wanted is a past tense verb because the action has already happened. Future tense verbs. 
verbs which tell about actions which are going to happen are future tense verb for example we will wake up at 6 am will wake up is a future tense verb because the action has not yet happened i hope this video was useful for you all meet you in the next video